Hi and welcome to another tutorial in the Make the Cut Basics tutorial series. In this lesson I'm going to show you how to use the corner handles on any item in Make the Cut to rotate, resize, and skew your project. So I'm going to start by just adding a custom shape to my mat and I'm just going to add a rounded square. So I'll double click on that and then click the X to close. Now you can see when the square lands on your mat it has these red handles all the way around and they're double sided arrows. Now if I want to resize this item, if I resize it proportionately, all I do is just grab one of the corner arrows and drag. And it will resize that item proportionately for me. If I want to stretch the item either horizontally or vertically, I can grab one of the side arrows and stretch and that resizes the item non-proportionately. Now if I click anywhere inside the item on my mat, just click once, now you'll see that these outside handles change and they've changed to double-ended arrows but you'll notice on the corners they're actually curved and then on the sides they're pointing up and down and to the sides. Now if I grab one of those corner arrows and drag, what that will do is actually rotate the item. And then if I grab one of the side arrows, basically skews the item from the side or from the top or bottom, depending on which arrow I grab. So this gives you a lot of flexibility in actually creating different items on your mat. And when you create a couple of items and then weld them together. You can make little animals or whatever you like. The possibilities are endless there. Now if I click on my shape one more time, I get these crosses. And if I grab one of the crosses and drag, what that does is actually skew, but only from that point. So you can see how that corner is just being pulled out, depending on where I move my mouse to and then if I grab one of the sides or the top or bottom again you can see I can pull that side around and really change the shape of the original round square that I started out with. So you can see that by resizing, rotating and skewing you can really come up with a lot of different effects for your shapes in Make the Cut. So that shows you the basics of how to use those corner handles to resize, rotate, and skew your shapes in Make the Cut. Have fun playing with that and creating lots of different designs.